Okay, so what is happening now is that Rudy Giuliani, the crooked lawyer uh, I used to have as my fixer, Rudy, some might call him my uh, cuckoo consigliere, Rudy, who kind of looks like Simon Bar Sinister in the old underdog cartoon. Rudy Giuliani said in the recent past that he would have to be a fool to go on about all the stupid bullshit lies we made up about the 2020 election on his radio show. All the lies we spewed, like rancid vomit, which caused Fox News to be sued for the better part of a billion dollars. The same lies that he said to the press corps in 2020. Of course, Biden didn't win the election. Who's going to believe that? Do you take us for fools? Do you think we are idiots? Uh, the same lies that Rudy Giuliani told an armed crowd of my murderous thugs on January 6th would turn him into a fool if they ever turned out to be lies. Rudy said that he would have to be a fool if he ever talked about on his radio show his sole source of income. He would get shit canned for that. And he would have to be a fool. OK, and so what I have found out just now, and this is not a joke. Well, actually, I did. it is kind of a joke if you think about it, is that Rudy Giuliani has now officially been shit canned from his radio show, his sole source of income, because he has stubbornly refused to stop spreading on his radio show, The Bullshit Lies, that we all made up and spread like vomit about the 2020 U.S. presidential election. So I'll let you all just go ahead and draw your own conclusions about that. Um, so I, I just like to say um, good luck to Rudy. I wish him well. It was really fun to use him like toilet paper for all those years and not even have to pay him. I'll always remember Rudy as, um, as an arrogant, pig-headed, amoral, vainglorious shithead, just like myself, and I wish him well. I really do. You know, maybe he should have played more of that one song by the, spe the specials on his radio show. A message to you, Rudy, listen to that song. Maybe he should have been playing that on heavy rotation on his show, and it wouldn't have ended up this way for him. And of course, trusting me, well, what can I say? And I hope his son, Rudy's son, isn't too put out when you know Rudy has to has to move in with him in New York, Felix Unger style, and starts leaving his gross, foul smelling socks soaking in the bathroom sink that they, a, that they have to share so he can save money on laundry. Uh, when Rudy starts clogging his son's shower drain that they have to share with whatever's left of his hair and his son has to forever be subjected to Rudy's awful smelly farts and everything, diarrhea leaking out of his head. I'm sure that we're all familiar. But beyond that, what can I say? You know, Rudy fucked up. He just really, really fucked up. He trusted me. And so now I just have to get the American public to do the same thing.